talking with Sheila Robb, the president of the Halliburton County Garlic Growers County Association. Garlic Growers Association. It's a name. mouthful, yes. <laughs> okay, and we're here tonight at uh, the Minnick Community Center on Thursday, May 5th. That's pretty good. Uh, Sheila, what, what uh, got you involved in garlic growing? Uh, my husband became interested in garlic, right. and so we just started growing it as a hobby. Right. And before we knew it, uh, you know, we kept increasing, and then people became interested in trying it, and it snowballed from there. Right. Uh, we started out with just a couple of hundred, and uh, uh, just before he died, we were we were do we were growing eight thousand. Wow. And it was all by hand, and what didn't go to any stores or any outlets. It was just people. People buying. Regular people, yeah. And we had a lot of uh, repeat customers, and about. Um, that was on nine um, that last year with Charlie, and then I think it was oh eight. No, I'm trying to remember <laughs> when we mm. started our association. I think it was I think it was 2008. We started this. So about three years ago. Yeah, and it just came apart because um, you know I guess we just wanted to get people involved and uh, want to let people know it's not hard to grow garlic. Right. It's not rocket science. No. If it was, we wouldn't be growing it. <laughs> <laughs> just a lot of hands-on, and, and we just kept learning more and more and more, and Charlie wanted to share his knowledge. Mm -hmm. And uh, so that's how it started with the association, just by other growers that we had met at the other workshops. And uh, then we um, we had our first garlic fest, and that's before we even had the association. Yes, right. so that was in 08. So right after the Garlic Fest, everybody was so thrilled about what happened and how successful it was um, that we uh, we formed the association right. right after that Garlic Fest. And how many members do you have now? Uh, we only have about um, half a dozen growers. Right. Yeah. So we're very small, but our mandate is to uh, make sure we keep quality for the garlic. Mm -hmm. So we're very careful about uh, membership. Um, we have to make sure people are, are growing it without chemicals, without pesticides, they're using good quality seed, um, and that way uh, we have a good reputation. Right. So people know when they buy from us, they know that it's good quality garlic. It's organic. It's True organic, organic grow. Yes. It's not certified. No. I don't think any of our members are certified. Mm -hmm. We just say that we grow it naturally and, um, you know, it costs a lot of money to certify. Mm. It's a lot of red tape you have to jump yeah. through. So we just let people know we're not certified, but it's grown naturally. And I noticed a big crowd here tonight. I mean, obviously yeah. more members than you have. So well, they're, they're, you know, they're, they're, um, on our website, halibutongarlic.ca, right. uh, we have a membership form, and it tells you what the criteria for membership mm -hmm. is. So if people are interested, then they look at that, that and if they're comfortable with those. Um, that criteria, then they're free to uh, approach us for membership. Very successful meeting tonight, too, yes, in terms I'm of numbers. Yes, yeah. so We tried to do something. This is our second workshop as an association. Great. Um, we, Charlie and I, were involved with other workshops, and at that time it was sponsored by the Farmers right. Association. And mm. then we went out on our own, formed our own association with the other members here. So. And just uh, just before we go, why should people grow garlic? <laughs> why? Well, first yeah. of all, if people like to eat garlic, right. then they should grow it themselves. Mm -hmm. Because you're not going to get quality garlic in the store. No. It's not grown in Canada. Therefore, it's not, uh, it, it can't, it doesn't store well, as people know. Mm -hmm. And uh, our garlic, if it's, if it's um, Grown, if it starts from good seed and it's grown properly and you do all of the right things, then where is it? It's here. Right there. Oh yeah, let's see that. It's not it's not a big garlic. No. But wow. you can see how solid that is, and that's ten months old. Wow. Ten months. Ten months. It was that's harvested great. mid July. Yeah. So that's ten months old. It's starting to just you can just put it in a little bit, but not very much. Yeah. And that's just the skin getting uh uh, crap.